Water that we use for the coffee and the tea come from the same spot, and guess what? It never gets cleaned. And while I'm going to go ahead and stop her right there. This lovely flight attendant is very misinformed. It's okay, I'm going to educate her and the flying public. The only thing she did get right is that the water tank is the only place where you get the water. The galleys and the lavatories sanitize regularly four times a year, if not more. Aircraft drinking water rule by the EPA and the FDA. There's multiple ways of doing this. Here they are. The latest one is the ozone treatment. This is the ozone machine. What this will do is be hooked up to the aircraft and ozone treated water will be pumped into the tanks and all the lines, disinfecting and cleaning out any kind of contaminants. Once again, four times a year, if not more. It is strictly regulated and followed by task cards. Not only that, we have to test the water as well. Qualified engineers will use sample kits such as this, seal them and ship them to laboratories. We'll perform tests on the water itself, making sure there are no contaminants and no bacteria. This is done even on a more frequent basis. We take this very seriously. We follow paperwork to the T. For the coffee makers, check it out. Here's your coffee maker. People don't know is the coffee maker has its own water heater. Water that comes out of there is close to boiling. Don't worry, your coffee and tea is just fine. I drink it all the time. Never had a problem. Oh, and on a side note, the coffee pots themselves get changed out on every single flight by catering. Enjoy! The more you know.